Hi there. A very different feel to the weather today, depending on whether you're in the east or the west in terms of cloud amounts and temperatures. Now, you might expect the finest weather to be in the east, given that's where high pressure resides. But that high is bringing a lot of low cloud into eastern areas and making it feel rather chilly. Meanwhile, plenty of spring-like sunshine. Western Scotland, Northern Ireland, parts of Wales in the southwest, although weather fronts to the west are going to bring increasing cloud amounts to the west of Northern Ireland. And some showery rain to parts of Cornwall through the afternoon, some heavy bursts here. Also some showery rain into eastern Scotland, northeast England, and a few showers still remaining across the East Midlands, East Anglia and the southeast, not as many as we saw on Tuesday. The rain in the east of Scotland and northeast England also associated with a lot of low cloud and some gloominess with that low cloud arriving from the North Sea and making it feel on the chilly side, six or seven Celsius on that North Sea coast. Contrast that with the potential for 14 Celsius somewhere like Devon in the increasingly strong sunshine, feeling very pleasant indeed where that happens. Into the evening, we're going to see those showers in the west continue for a time, but actually they'll become lighter and fewer. They'll also become lighter and fewer across eastern areas, although we'll keep the low cloud and the mist and murk across eastern Scotland, parts of northern England, and that cloud will tend to drift westwards through the night, but we'll keep the clearest skies in the west, and where we do have prolonged clear spells, a touch of frost, and some freezing fog patches as well. So a chilly start, whether you've got the cloud or more especially whether you've got the clear spells and the patchy fog first thing Thursday. Most places start the day dry, but as the sun gets to work and warms the air up, the cloud will bubble up. It will tend to lift, so it'll be brighter by the afternoon, but we'll see these heavy showers developing. Now, showers could affect just about anyone across central, southern and uh, northeastern UK, but they'll particularly be focused through the Midlands into east and southeast Wales, where could be some lively downpours, but they'll be hit and miss, as is always the case with these kinds of showers. Some places will escape them and stay dry. Northern Ireland, Western Scotland, West Wales, Southwest England. Again, the best places to be for sunny spells, although it would be breezier, so that's going to make it feel a bit cooler. Now into the evening, we're going to see those showers continue to rumble on for a time, especially across these central areas. Increasingly, the focus will drift north and they will ease through the evening and overnight as well. So by the time we get to Friday, a drier day is expected and there will also be some pleasant sunshine, especially in the west. So make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel so you never miss an update. Bye bye.